Hey guys, we're playing a little bit of Fallout 4 again today. I found something that's pretty interesting. You know that neat little set scale command that you can use to make a uh, teensy teensy little NPCs? Yes, I made him small for a reason. And you could also use this command to make things absolutely huge. Set scale 10. Kaboom! Do all kinds of craziness. Well, you could actually do this to yourself. And your HUD scales to your size. So let's check it out. Set scale 10. Kaboom! And I am a giant! Look at that. I mean, that's so awesome. And you could do this to yourself. To all the NPCs. Hell, let's let's do it with a building. Let's do it with a building. Oh, some stuff I guess doesn't work. Now I think you might be able to set individual objects and make them huge, but it has to be specific things. Um, one thing you want to do, of course, this is only available on PC, and yes, it's a little bit hard to see myself. So you're going to have to use the toggle flying camera to zoom around. But as you can see, it's a bit ridiculous and awesome. And I like it a lot. One thing you're going to have to do though, if you actually plan to actually play this game like a giant or like a little miniature, you want to turn on toggle god mode for a little bit. Because when you jump as a giant, you jump crazy high. And you run like a crackhead. I mean, look at this. Now, I have run into multiple crashes while playing like this. And it's not advised to play for like an extended period of time like this. But it is very interesting. And I, I didn't think the set scale command could be applied to myself. And that it would scale my HUD like this. It's pretty neato. So let's go ahead and... Okay, so... You want to shrink yourself back down. You're like, okay, I don't want to be a giant anymore. What you have to do is turn on toggle flying camera because it's the only way that you could actually see yourself. You can't really zoom out. Oh, geez. Oh, I'm stuck. Okay. Here's another thing you're going to run into. So let's go ahead, go into our third person view. Now you want to be in third person before you do toggle flying camera. That way you're not just locked like I was just before. So let's go ahead, shrink myself back down, set scale. The set scale command goes in increments of all the way down to 0 0.01 or 0 0.1 or to 10. So you got increments of 1 to 10 for, for in beginning or shrinking. And then the smaller sizes go down to decimal points down to 0 0.01. So let's go ahead and let's do 1, go back to our default size. Just to give you another example of this scale. So now we're back to default. Back to normal. And let's go for some actual mini mouse action. Set scale, 0.1. Kaboom! Oh my god, I'm a mouse! Oh! Oh, this is crazy! Thank you. It's like I can finally think straight. Let's see, let's see how big we are compared to his boot. Oh wait. Oh, we didn't go in the third person view. Gotta go in third person view before you toggle flying camera. Toggle flying camera. Oh my god, we're so tiny. Oh, the camera's a bit janky. Look at that. Or Ant Man. This is so awesome. I love this. So it's just, you could play around with all kinds of things in this game, and it just gets fun the more time you use it. I get an idea. Let's go. Of course, we're super slow. We are just like rocking small man action. And we can't even really jump. Look at this. It's like Honey, I Shrunk the Kids. That is awesome. And you can apply this to anything. So let's go over here to our robots. Oh, okay. Uh, let's adjust our speed. So player set AV speed molt. Let's do 20. And our, oh, no, we need we need more. We need more. Let's go 2,000. 
Boom! Alright. So, let's go to our robots. Set scale, point three. Make some toy robots. Let's make some giant robots. Remember, the increments go... <laughs> I just love this, man. I love it. The increments only go in... The maximum size is 10. But that's enough. That That's enough. I mean, yeah. you don't you don't need five six hundred feet robots. Uh, are we selecting her? There we go. There we go. I mean, look at that. That's that's enough. Um, power armor works. Power armor too. Let's go ahead and jump in the power armor. Should be able to. So we're like two inches tall. Entering power armor. I guess it doesn't work too well. Let's go ahead and shrink the power armor so we can actually get into inside of it. Set scale point one. That's not working. Some stuff works and some stuff doesn't. It's a bit disappointing. You could shrink little cars sometimes. Oh well, can't get in the power armor. Can't really see myself in a uh, third-person view. The camera is a little janky. Let's go ahead and shrink this guy. Point. Let's try point oh one. No, didn't work. Huh. Okay. Hmm. I don't think we're selecting the right thing. We're we selecting him. I think we're getting some interference somewhere. Oh well. I guess he's not going to work too well. But it just gets wacky, man, and I love it. I mean, look at look at him! Ah, giants everywhere! Hey! Hey! Cola is the only thing I can drink that wakes me Nuka Cola. Up. Oh, sometimes the uh, huge monsters will disappear. They'll just randomly disappear because they're so goddamn massive, and they'll appear out of nowhere again. But this is something fun you can do. Let's try to shrink the car. Now, in my experience, I have had luck shrinking certain things I know that tiny car the little three three wheel car you can usually shrink that thing oh did I make the grass bigger I think I'm selecting the grass uh, you got all kinds of interference all these items and everything well I guess that's not gonna work this actually let's go to third person view remember we have to do that first talk flying camera Zoom out. Oh, we were in third person then. Okay. Turn the flying camera. Zoom out. Oh, jeez. What happened? Are we stuck as a mouse? I think that I repeatedly shrank myself to the point where I can't. Let's turn on our HUD. So I had my HUD off. So let's see if we can do that. Oh geez, we're so small our gun doesn't even appear. Okay, now we're in first person. Okay. There we go. Okay. Let's look how small we are. Tog a flying camera. Okay. Let's go ahead and select ourselves. Set scale 10. Let's make ourselves bigger. Tog a flying camera. All right, and we are just gigantic and awesome. Let's go ahead and get a nice little screenshot. Oh, am I stuck? You're gonna get stuck on things, and, and the game could crash at any moment. It's it's one of those types of deals, but it's worth it. it this is just so entertaining. You get into battles, like 300, 3,000 feet tall, just gets ridiculous and of course he's turning away whenever I want him okay let's get a screenshot let's turn it off for a HUD to get a better screenshot and you could just generally have fun what it reminds me of is the Mario levels where was it like stage five and six where everything's small and huge got some epic screenshots going here 
So yeah, I just wanted to show you guys this. Something neat that I came across. I hope you have a blast with it like I did. Because this is genuinely like one of the most enjoyable things. Now you notice when we did our epic battles with the console command battles. I showed you that you could actually shrink and raise things like that. And actually set up your own battles. We'll include a link to that video below so you could actually check that out too. So hope you enjoyed it. Uh, don't forget to link, share, and subscribe. And we'll see you next time.